And good morning, everybody. Not often enough do I meet women who are ambitious and smart in Hollywood movies. They're usually not so smart, only identified by what they do for a guy or what they do to kind of get a guy. I don't meet the smart, young, ambitious women you're about to meet right now. They come from a company called Recouture. They own it themselves. They design clothes, and which is a perfect thing because right now fashion is it. I guess it always has been. We have here Heather, Heather Arcega, Arcega, and Heather. Mm -hmm. You are here with your partner in business, Janu. 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 I am really doing well. Okay, Janu and Heather. And you both own Recouture. Yes. And what, tell us how you define your company, Heather, before we see some of your fashions. Well, Recouture is inspired by both of us. We design together, and then I do the pattern work, and then we sew together. Um, we take traditional Indian sari fabrics, and we mm. upgrade them with a modern, modern twist. Very contemporary, very sexy, and very beautiful. Wow. Did you ever think you'd be in business, Janu, like this? Um, actually, I mean, it's kind of something I always thought about since little, because I'd look at all my Indian outfits and think, how can I make this more American since I grew up here? I love the fabrics, but... Um, I just kind of wanted to merge them, and that's what we did. So. It's wonderful, and you're both so young, and yet you have this company together, and you've had it for over a year, and you're still speaking to each other. <laughs> I mean, do you find working together, you get that good energy? And we love it. We have a good good time. <laughs> Isn't that yeah. great? And it's a good role model to other young women, right, who are interested in fashion. So let's see some of what you've brought with you, okay? okay. I wish we had some music to cue, but instead <laughs> we'll just have you talk about it. Go ahead, Heather. This first one. This is the Mishy dress, and it's very corseted. We have patchwork in it. It's all recycled fabrics and silks from Johnny's mother's saris so we're very green isn't that fabulous yeah. from your mother's saris yes. these beautiful fabrics plus because they're custom made couture you could do it for any size yes. i mean how great is that gorgeous oh thank you so much so and um, that's named after um, mishi right that's yes. named after her <laughs> i love that the models say hey okay you don't have to pay me but name the dress after me okay and fabulous next tell us a little bit about this one jenny um so this is a sarah haley dress um over here this a little bit open this way. This there we go. This dress is a patchwork skirt, pencil skirt with rouge mm, sides. Great. With a halter top. Love it. Um, <laughs> this skirt took me a while. I mean, it was when I was figuring out how to patchwork, so it probably took me two days to sew the skirt. So how did I we get you guys on that TV show, that uh, Project Runway, and all that? How does that happen? Do they just discover you? I mean, look at these little details. They're just <laughs> fabulous. Beautiful, sweetheart. Beautiful. Thank you. And that is us, uh, uh, Smithy. Ms. Smithy. Yes. And next we have another one of you. So how does that go? I mean, do you put your fashions into consideration for Project Runway? Well, they won't take us as a pair, and we only yeah. come as a pair. All right. So we're, we're dynamic duo. If, you, if they'll, you know, change the rules for us, then we definitely come on. <laughs> you go, girl. Absolutely. <laughs> Sisterhood is powerful. This one fascinates me because of the back. But explain this dress. This is a gingerbread dress, and I have had my own um, business before I joined into RE. Um, for five years I've been designing my own and this is a black ruched corset dress and the mm -hmm. back is different. Right, now show the back, show the back, yeah. Isn't that interesting? I love that back detail, just go like that. There we go. Very unusual. Oh, Kim Novak. This is, you have an old Hollywood sense here, yes. even though, uh, I mean, are you into that? Do you, do you I, study? I am very into it. Uh -huh. I like the really romantic look, but mm -hmm. I definitely have an edge to it too. Right. Thank you. Yeah, there's an edge, a new edge, and this was actually a wedding dress you made yes. from your from uh, what? From it was actually the Harper Arsu wedding. Mm -hmm. It was a bridesmaid's dress for my brother's wedding. Who was last? It was last Saturday. Oh, terrific! So. so, okay, and one more. We have one more. Now, this is very old Hollywood to me. This is very Joan Crawford, Jean Harlow, and you can make it in any size. I love this outfit. Tell me about this. This is another gingerbread kimono outfit. We also have one in Ricotour, but they're both similar. This is made out of China silk, and it has the elongated kimono sleeves. Oh, wonderful. And the front tie. And these are slimming pants, too. <laughs> these are be beautiful, just beautiful. 
such great detail. So thank you so much. Wonderful. Now, uh, and that's Anna Maria. So um, you have a daughter named Chanel. Hi, so there. you your influences would be what? Uh, Chanel and Chanel. women that really wanted women to feel great about how they look. Uh -huh. It's a wonderful new movie about that, by the way, uh, that I'll be reviewing in the next uh, hour. Uh, it's called Coco Before Chanel. Oh. So your influences were people um, like that? Not really designers. Mostly my mom. She's a very empowered, strong, kind of all-around... I can't say it. Bad, yeah. Bad, awesome girl. <laughs> <laughs> Fantastic. I hope she's watching. That's wonderful. So uh, we love what you're doing here and that you're using the saris that already are made and just remaking them and making it hip and wonderful. What would you tell young women, the main thing before we tell people how they can reach you? What's one piece of advice for young women who want to go into fashion? Oh, go for it. Go for it. And don't be afraid. Have fun with it. Yes. <laughs> Have fun and don't be afraid. Don't be I find afraid. a lot of fear <laughs> running a lot of young women. Forget it, kids. Get out there and do it. People will respect you for it and you'll respect yourself. Here's how you can see Ricoeur in real life, in person. There's an art explosion happening in this one building that has painters and all kinds of unusual art in it. Uh, October 9th, 7 to 11th, October 10th to 11th, 11 to 6th in San Francisco. Uh, it's in the mission. Uh, if you want to find out more, go to www.artexplosions.com. Uh, um, dot com, but to get to them, it's recouture dot com. www dot r i c o u t u r e recouture dot com. They do any size, any kind, and they do it great, and they do it green. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much for Thank being you. with us and reminding everyone how bright and ambitious young women are. Oh, if Hollywood would only listen, Marty, back <laughs> to you. <laughs>